Night Force. NIP will start to see aggressors. Twist has got the P250. He's got that extra range. There are flashes and smokes for the Swedish team. On the CT side of things, Twist has the kind of traditional smoke grenade and diffuse kit. Trivia, once we set off a smoke grenade in our office and it, the fire brigade had to come. NIP will be going into the B-bomb site. No fire brigade for Team Liquid. They have to fight it out and defuse any flames themselves. Nitro patiently waiting by the bench, playing off of his teammates. Three kills so far for Team Liquid, two for Nitro. And uh, Twist now is suddenly wondering where all of his teammates have gone. He's, again, he's got that extra range with the P250, but there are too many men on the B-bomb site, and Team Liquid will take the pistol. That looked really easy. They were set up, ready, and it wasn't until the, it was a 5v1 that even a player got damaged from Team Liquid. Can't really ask for all that much better. Lovely stuff. It's always a strong angle the Nitro is playing if you have uh, a cross, if you can crossfire it with somebody else towards the, the pillar or whatever it might be. And uh, Liquid start off with that money control. We'll see a few FAMAS, or a couple of FAMAS brought to bear. And we have a pause, and Twist is having a, he's having a giggle. <laughs> not sure what's going on. Just to, just to compose himself again. I've never seen him laugh that much. I actually had a, had a quick chat with uh, with Nitro yesterday. I played Counter-Strike randomly with, with his brother on Face It a few weeks ago while I was out in North America. He's a really nice guy. And uh, it was pretty cool, actually. He was you know ready to organize the team and suggest rats and so on. It was a, gr it was a great time. Jolly nice chap. I was like, mostly, I was mostly sure it was actually his brother, but I wasn't 100% sure. But Nitro was like, hey, you played my brother the other day. So I was like, ah, oh, so it was your brother. <laughs> I see, I see. Well, I, I don't know that. Uh, I don't know what to expect from this NIP lineup. This is a map where, you know, historically, uh, with Lecro, they have had some really crazy games. Like, I, I remember when Lecro first started, you know, IGLing, there were games against, you know, uh, Astralis, when Astralis were super dominant, where they were just putting Astralis through their paces on this map, and you know, over times and so on and so forth. So it, it's definitely a map that plays well in terms of NIP skill sets, and I think that's really the the, the thing that I think Sean made a great point on this in the pregame analysis that NIP are strong and they're playing better and better. But when it comes to the map pool, it's actually something where by this, you know, if you if you're listing off, oh, you know, this is the reason why they're going to be really good at Mirage. You can kind of make the same argument for Liquid, and but Liquid are just a, a better team overall, and have the results to kind of back that up. So that's kind of where you're looking at the map and being like, oh well, I'm not really sure where NIP are going to go, but you know, we'll see if they can get a great individual uh, performance and maybe a couple of players overperforming. That would go a long way. And we're back into it, and it is going to be a full save for NIP. They did not plant the bomb, so we'll see no shenanigans in round two. And that's a smoke that goes deep on the apps. It's an easy one to learn. And that's just going to slow things down a little bit. I've got to say, teams are getting better at, in rounds like this, not dumping all their utility. Because everybody plays these rounds slow to try to bait out CT utility, but... Okay, so Nitro's got the bait from Nafly. Just like in the pistol, Nitro's playing off of his teammate. It's not going to check for him, though. Great awareness from Ninjas in pajamas. However, the round doesn't look great for them, and it shouldn't in a round such as this. Nitro will deal with the matter. Naf for support, of course. The bomb's been lost, so Team Liquid need not defend the rest of the map. We can hold the off angles. Twist is in a good position. An IP, what will the remainder do? Twist and Rares with two Glocks. Two Glocks are turned into one. The Dragon Tattoo Glock, one of the original skins in the game, at least for the Glock. I still have mine. Do you have MP7 spell, Dan? Uh, I don't, actually. I mean, I rarely use the MP7. I, the thing is, it's great. It's a great weapon, but the price point just doesn't make sense for me. Uh, yeah, especially now that, um, like, the Gillow's 1800, right? It's um, yeah. the value proposition. Like, the MP7's in a weird space at the moment, a weird place. If it was $1,500, I think I'd buy a lot more, because that price point of the, of the MP9 is just so much. I'm, like, almost always thinking I just get the MP9 instead. The MP9 is really good. Either way, we get the four Kriegs coming out here in round three with a decent chunk of utility behind it. NIP know they have the firepower superiority, therefore they can just swing on top middle. There's no aggression from Team Liquid there, but there is in the palace. Naf finds himself a great <laughs> off angle against Rez, and that's the upgrade. Krieg for Naf. Not bad for Team Liquid start on this one. They have had to give up middle, so they needed to take something else, and, and it will be Palace. Oh, actually, uh, Twist has been gifted the Krieg by Naf. 
And IP just standing their ground, maybe waiting for a, a re-aggression from Team Liquid in mid. Nothing doing just yet. Stewie so comfortable in that connector position from Cloud9 to Team Liquid. Plenty of aggressive plays there. So at the minute mark, we have a smoke of the window by Ninjas in Pajamas, but there's no obscuring of the vision on short or through connector at the moment. They will head towards the B bomb site. Now, our Liquid Nervous of a pop flash play into connector, something like that. Actually, they're pretty far away from the mid position, apart from Stewie, who as the smoke goes, he will see that nobody's in mid. He's not shy to peek, but where does he go? They've still got to play a deep in pallet, and indeed, Stewie will make his way towards the B bomb site in response. Some flashbangs out, but Nitro is there, protected from those flashes on the site. He's got support as well. Stewie is there with him, and uh, it's looking impossible to breach this bomb site. NIP aren't able to get anything here. They need some damage at the very least. Lecro, that's his mission now. Get a kill, get two kills. Try to make this cost something for NIP, but the flashbangs are going to do so much. Lecro still somehow gets a kill out of it, and another headshot. So, I mean, the objective of getting a couple kills is, is completed, but, but ultimately that otherwise was a terrible round for NIP. Yeah, he really squeezed a lot of value out of that round. And it's kind of strange in that it, that round was so successful for Team Liquid, apart from those few dying seconds where one man is dying on his sword. So that's a, that's, a, that's a really unfortunate way for Liquid to win that round, to lose all those players at the very end. But indeed, they still have two Kriegs, Team Liquid, on the likes of Twist and Nitro. But NIP are back on the pistol, so it's a chance for Liquid to recoup some of that money they just lost. Having a look around, NIP not starting too fast in mid, just in case of some aggression from Team Liquid. Looks very slow here from NIP so far, and Liquid are kind of feeling that pace. And Leech will take an aggressive move, using that smoke to cover him from any top mid swing, and he gets a pick off, so that's, that's really nice. You know, one of the potential dangers has been eliminated and NIP have to start thinking to themselves, all right, we've got all these, these grenades, we've invested in this utility. We have to try to convert that into position that gives us a bomb plan. And to do that, here we go. The rotation through back, uh, back through T-spawn in towards A. But the real danger is Twist. He's playing a close position towards the ramp and that should probably shut down all of these efforts, I would imagine. Really slow rounds here, but again, it's all about squeezing out as much as you can. Just to make a good towards into that round. Your grenade into the side, a shadow spotted from Twiz. Happy to stand as Grand Plopski will finish off the job over the Creek. Uh, Creek was the season. Forest and Twist remain 25 seconds. A bomb plant would be outstanding in a situation such as this. All the team liquid are here, so it's not looking likely bomb spotted and swatted. And Stewie will finish off the job, so just the one player lost is acceptable for Team Liquid as they move forward into the next round. I actually shot a CZ75 in, in Dallas this week. Which um, I was wondering if if, it would, if the uh, magazine would stick out like it does in the game, and maybe there's a, like an alternative option for it, but it looked relatively normal and un uninspiring, not exciting uh, at all, to be honest. <laughs> it's uh, good to see that you know, Stewie is having a good start. He's someone whose performances individually have been called into question. You know, we, we talked a little bit about it on our podcast. I, I recorded with him not too long ago, which will be coming out soon. And it's it's going to be very difficult for NIP to break this momentum. It, you know, Sean said that we've got a very confident Liquid, and Liquid at a leash just poking up from from stairs. He gets three kills. This is he's making it look like an anti-eco. They got full. This is a full buy. All the Kevlar, all the nades, all the Kriegs. Yeah, all the kills with a leash. Oh my God, James, this is not a good start. Yeah, they, they're, they're getting stuck in the choke points, it seems, on both sides. When we saw them over towards B earlier, it kind of reminded me of um, a Cloudline pistol run they used to run, where Tarek would stand on the balcony and spawn. I think she could do the throw the pop flash. And I made a video of NIP getting absolutely devastated by that. But indeed, they are uh, be making that many inroads. The StarCraft aim from Allegia is a problem on the A bomb site for Ninjas in Pajamas who still have a big fat zero, so does Rez. His score tells the story of the overall game as well, zero and five. So again, we might see another slow round here with a late execute from Ninja's Pajamas. Uh, but really, I think it's all eyes on, I mean, this, they, may, maybe they win this round, but I think the, the main curiosity for me, we've got, we've got those new stickers on Stewie's AWP, by the way. 
um, the Halo stickers. The main curiosity for me is um, what can NIP bring into the next buy rounds? Again, they started slow top mid in one round. They had three players um, hanging out. Team Liquid didn't weren't interested in engaging. We had a minute mark smoke over the window, and then they went towards B with no presence in mid. With, an, with a player like Stewie for Team Liquid, he's, he's going to pick that. He's not going to make any assumptions. He's aggressive. He is confident in his own skills. He wants those jaws. He's got that NA style, and he will deliver with it. So I think they need, they need to bring something more than that into their T side executes in the rounds to come. It's a cool base setup here as well in this this kind of a round where maybe you're anticipating a B play. Nitro will be the one to get that information aggressively, and then he falls off, and then immediately there's a crossfire, and that should probably just destroy this round. We'll see how the utility of the flashbangs work out, and if they if this base setup actually works, or if they still check that close position. But indeed, it feels like Team Liquid they are just. So, just taking so much of a command of the entire map in these rounds. And here we go. The bait setup has it worked. Okay, looks like they won't be checking for Naf. He's going to pull the trigger immediately, though, and he is going to open himself up to a trade. But Nitro and Co. will do the rest. Just Lecro left with the CZ, and it's not too much. You never know, Lecro. 15 seconds, so it won't be easy to break through the smoke. <laughs> the smoke is gone now. 10 seconds. You kind of need to die, Lecro. He's just was pretty uninspired. I don't know if they're afraid of a counterplay from Liquid if they have put more people there, but I think they need to do <laughs> excuse me, something more substantial um, if they go in that direction. But on this occasion, they're going for a straight A play, so maybe they're just not so confident in the middle position just yet, or this is just the next page of their strap book they want to try. Two-man balcony burst looks likely. The standard A with smokes. <laughs> I think it's supposed to be a boost for the Molotov towards the triple position. So we've got a retake situation for Liquid. They're like, okay, we'll open the doors for you guys. Then we're coming back in again with the flashbangs and so on. Two freak through the dashboard of the car and that. NIP starting to creep out. Lots of pre-fire, but again, Liquid are just biding their time. And while NIP clear out all these positions, the smokes will come and go, as we've seen in the re-smoke. But when the bomb gets planted, Liquid will have this site surrounded. There'll be no need for rotation because they will all already be here. Yeah, they have the Molotovs. There's a nice boost. Stewie, great flick, finds Forest, and there it is. The retake utility starts to come in, starts to pressure, starts to create problems. Quick kill on Toplovsky from that incendiary. Lecro with a nice trade, but he's critically weak now, and they have nowhere to stand. Getting sprayed through the wood. Res down, very, very weak. Nitro coming in. He's got a 2k lined up for him, surely. It will be a twist to finish off Res after all. Twist now. CTs and T's born. No CTs, obviously, in all the other places you would expect to see them. No pressure from NIP.
bomb has been planted.